Today we are back to explore the riddles that scientists in China still can't figure out to this day, okay? Let's just jump into it. Today we are back once again reacting to 7 second riddles. You guys seem to really enjoy the first one and to be honest, I had so much fun recording that. And sure, the riddles are not always the greatest riddles and maybe they're really easy, but you know what? I actually had the time of my life reacting to them, so you know, check them out down below. The channel that comes out with 20 videos per day. I don't know how they do that. <laughs> but let's put on our 300 IQ caps right now and see if we can uh, survive. This will be dangerous. Oh, okay, let's start with this one. 13 crime riddles and tricks for fresh fresh what she loved him but killed him why that's so dark what happened <laughs> all right let's see if my brain can comprehend these who killed anna anna was found dead in her house oh oh her mobile was next to her body <laughs> six four 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 five five three three should i call that number guys i don't know the primary suspects were her mother Amy. Ooh, those glasses do look suspicious. Oh, and her stepfather, Rick. Well, he is a stepfather, and I feel like that already makes you a suspect. Her neighbor, Mike. Oh my god. <laughs> I swear I didn't do it. That is not me, okay? Brown hair, glasses, same name, Mike. I swear I didn't do it. FBI comes through the door. Ah! Her boyfriend, John. Having analyzed the scene of the crime, the police arrested the murderer. What do I have to go off of? I mean, you could give me a, a, a clue, anything. What do you want from me? What do I do? Comments? I, I, the mic. Uh, Mike did it. I don't know. Is the number supposed to, like, give you the information? This old phone uses T9. Oh, holy crap. Okay. I didn't even think of that. Okay, now I feel dumb. So if you guys don't know what T9 is, if it's, okay, back in your day, all right, or back in my day, I should say, there was this thing when we we had flip phones. Uh, yes, I had this red cool flip phone and I texted at the speed of light. I literally did not have to look. Like with touch screens, you can sort of do it, but it's not really accurate. And a lot of times you end up messing up. But back in the day, you could fill the buttons on your phone. So uh, there was this thing called T9. And so it was very, very easy to text. Like you could text at the speed of light. Uh, at least I could. I did send like 5,000 messages a month. I did not have a life. Okay, still don't. But yeah. But as you put the numbers in, it would like guess uh, what you were typing. I don't, I can't exactly remember how it worked. Basically, there can only be a certain number of combinations that you could have using those numbers. So it would autocomplete the word and it was really fast to do that. So hers is 6444. So 6MNO. Ooh. <laughs> I, I am so confused. The fact that they they use they use the number four three times is very confusing. What? I don't know. I can't figure it out. So if she wanted to type a name. She would six button once. Okay, four button three times. Oh, is that how T9 worked? That's not how T9 works. No, I refuse to believe that. That is not, that is the regular texting way. T9, yeah, see, right here, it says it right here, okay? I'm calling, I'm calling you out. Seven minutes, seconds. <laughs> My new channel name coming up. T9's objective is to make it easier to send text messages, okay? I am like, I'm, it's like Death Note. I'm like L from Death Note right now, okay? Objection! Well, that's ace attorney, but you get it. It allows words to be formed by a single key press for each letter, letter which is an enormous improvement over the multi-tap uh, approach using conventional mobile text, in which several letters are associated with each key, and selecting one letter often requires multiple pressing. So that is not T9, and this this is all false. So it's no wonder I couldn't freaking figure it out. It didn't make any sense. But now, with the knowledge that we have, it's multi-tap and not T9. Therefore, I can figure out who the murderer is so it's m i it's it's mike it's it's mike oh crap i swear officers okay all right i'll, I'll put him i'll put him behind my back i didn't know all along that i did it holy crap i just randomly clicked this video too guess we're going to jail oh and i would have gotten away with it too if it wasn't a bunch of Silly kids. Did he kill his wife? A man told the police he came back home after work and found his wife dead. Oh, that looks pretty sad about it. She found his gun and shot- Oh, jeez. The police knew he was lying. Why? Oh, I already see a, a shady knife going in the back. Okay. Uh, okay. Think about it. Okay. So he's got a knife in the back. Really weird to have that on the coffee table, right? She's also bleeding. Uh, and there is a glass broken next to her. So clearly, he hit her with that and pl it planted the gun in her hand. That is clearly what happened, okay? Oh, he had, he has a holster! He has a freaking holster! <laughs> ah! My wife, ah! The green knife is a red herring. It's just to throw you off. The man has an empty gun holster on his belt. Oh, that was it. That was literally it. <laughs> I should be a detective or a lawyer! Okay, why are you slowly zooming in on this 
Sleep deprived officer. One, three. What are they doing? Are they speaking in code? What the heck? Three. Is he gonna say five? Yep, I knew it. It's two off. Oh, he knows. <laughs> This creepy bearded man, idiots, it's so obvious. He creeps me out. God, who is this guy? Five, eight, no, oh, seven, dig it. Oh, you're going to jail. Everyone knows eight's the jail number, okay? I don't know. It's eight. No, I, I don't know. <laughs> he said one, she said three. One, two, three. So he said five, six, seven, eight. It's eight. Eight's the real answer, right? You guys didn't let me live the last riddle down that we did, which by the way, didn't make any sense. Still to say, you guys explain it in the comment section. If you've seen the last episode, check it out. You only have a little bit of time. What's the answer? Answer was four. What? Four? One contains three letters. Three contains five letters. And five contains four letters. That's actually pretty freaking smart. You threw me off! Oh god, I would have never guessed that. That was a good one. You got me. Spot the sniper before he shoots you. Oh god. Oh god, I played enough Apex Legends to know. He's not there. Maybe he's behind the timer? Oh jeez. Oh god. <laughs> That's a sniper? I can't see. Well, this is just blatantly obvious. You went from like 10 difficulty to like negative difficulty. He's right there. It's like, no, he's actually right here. Ah! Yeah, yeah, thanks. Thank you. I would have never guessed that one. Okay, he's literally right there. The first one was like impossible though. I need you to tap your screen right now. <laughs> Guys, smash like if you found the sniper. Here, I'll come up with my own. Can you find the sniper on the screen right now? Guys, can you find the sniper? The prize is a date with Clarence Boy. If you can find the sniper, please tap like, send screenshot, follow me on Twitter, and also follow me on the Twitch I never use, okay? Hurry up. Oh, time's up. Did you find the sniper? There actually what never was a sniper. Too bad. Who is a man? <laughs> Who has a vampire baby inside? <laughs> oh, my favorite one. Who is poor? Ah, okay, yes. <laughs> Which family sleeping on the street tonight? What's wrong here? Um... Uh... Ah, uh, there is left-hand traffic in London. Yeah, I knew that. <laughs> What's wrong here? Oh God, it's it's Wednesday. Is it hump day? I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. I gotta pause it. It's cheating. I know it's cheating. I, sh I should have paused it. But what's wrong here, actually? One of the camels was fake. <laughs> I don't know. No shadows. I don't know. How am I supposed to know if that's the art style? And clearly there is shadows. Look at right here. Pull the yank in my chain here. What's wrong here? Well, someone has a vampire baby, so I guess vampires are okay in this... Seven second universe. Vampires don't really like, don't reflect the mirror, stupid. That actually is true, dang. Okay, oh God, what's wrong here? Uh, the mom's head is way too freaking big. Uh, oh God, I can't, I don't actually know though. No milk in the jug. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> okay, what is wrong here? All right, okay, there's shadows. Okay, I gotta count the flags. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are way too many stripes on that. <laughs> oh my God. I actually didn't even count them. Oh God, there's two moons. How much would kill you? God, this freaking wit. Dark fast. Water, six liters. Coffee, 70 cups. I feel like sometimes if I have two cups of coffee, I'll have a heart attack. These aren't riddles. These are facts. Chocolate, 59 bars. Okay, thanks for the facts. I don't need to know what's gonna kill me now. All right, okay, I'm good. This one again? Okay, so I guess since we're here, uh, you guys you guys were saying that the rifle was like backwards? Actually, I don't, it's not backwards. It's just a weird looking rifle, right? Yeah, that has like no, it had like no back on it. That was very freaking weird. But spoiler alert, if you didn't watch last episode, Avalanche. Even if they're star starving natives living in the Antarctic will never eat a penguin's egg. Why? Because they care about penguins. Oh, it's, uh, I'm tired. I'm tired of crap, seven seconds. A man is asked what his daughter looks like. He answers, they are all blondes, but two, all brunettes, but two, uh, and all redheads, but two. How many daughters does he have? Well, first of all, he has a speech impediment. None of that made any sense. It sounds like he's got like 16 daughters. <laughs> it sounds like he's got like at least six of them. One blonde, one brunette, and one redhead. But two. But he kept saying but two. It just throws me off. It, I don't I don't get that one. You guys are gonna explain it to me. The police raid a house to arrest a suspected murder. Er. <laughs> er. They don't know what he looks like. They know his name is John and he is inside the house. The police went into the house. Ooh, I like that sneaky animation. And saw four people playing poker. Carpenter, lorry driver, mechanic, fireman. Without hesitation, they arrest the fireman. Oh God, why? Why? Well, I mean, it's kind of a weird thing to be like these people in a group. It's kind of weird, and they're in uniform. Why? John the fireman. Uh, why do they do the fireman like that? He's trying to put out fires, and you're arresting him. So the next fire that comes out, no one's gonna put it out. Sure, is it gonna be the mechanic? I mean, it is odd for them all to be in uniform. 
The fireman is the only man in the room. Oh my god. It's true. Oh god. <laughs> I didn't even catch that. I thought it was art style. Who is the cannibal? Oh, Jesus. The one with blood on him. Okay, okay. All right. All right, wait. Oh, can you spot it? It's like Blue's Clues. Guys, <laughs> can you spot it? Okay, yeah, again, guys, did you see it? Number A has a freaking fingers. <laughs> I like how she looks so happy too. <laughs> oh, oh, another cannibal. God, I, I hate the blurriness. He's got a, oh God, he's got a cut on him and an eyeball on his badge. I don't know if that's like, it uh, means anything. Uh, I'm gonna go with A or no, no, B. I'm gonna go with B. The first one's too obvious. She's got blood on her. <laughs> Comments? <laughs> Like, I just imagine, like, when they're creating, they're just like, okay, this one actually doesn't need to make any sense because we're gonna slap them with the comments. Who is poor? Who just has an unwrapped fish in their freezer, by the way? And who, who leaves all of this like that? Like, the freaking crazy chick doesn't put no Tupperware or nothing. Uh, ah, uh, God, who is poor? You better not get me with the comments. The obvious one is B. It's obviously B. She's got less food. Sure, she has some kind of expensive stuff. I guess that ham probably cost her a pretty penny, but I don't freaking know. Kim Possible is the one that's poor. <laughs> and she looks like Kim Possible. It's obviously B. Don't you freaking say it! <laughs> Who has three kids? Who's a floozy? Who's not a floozy? We'll never know, or will we? Comments. Here we go. Who has three kids? I mean, definitely not. Th I'm guessing not the one with abs, because I know when you have kids, it's uh, it, it causes problem well problems. I wouldn't say problems, but it causes your body to change now. They all look great um, I mean, I I have no idea uh, the, the B one looks like it doesn't get any sleep and they might you know go around the streets at night So I'm gonna say B. Now that doesn't necessarily mean you'll have kids either I mean, there's not really much going on, but she looks like she's lost some sleep and therefore I think she is a hooker so yeah, okay stop. It's actually really creepy that you're zooming in like this now. Okay, please stop making me uncomfortable You're a romantic and gentle person, but tend to lose yourself in a relationship You're strong and active and always get what you want, but you often hold back to your close people Oh wait, is that like is this a, it's turned into a personality test now? You're quite an introvert and secretive person and don't completely trust even your loved ones also has three kids How is this answering who has three kids? You see what I mean? It doesn't freaking make any sense I don't know who has three kids. They didn't say this is what I'm talking about you guys you guys in the comments right now you're so stupid beat out Mike you should have freaking knew it's it clearly is day said who had three kids I missed it I'm going on a vacation for two weeks I need a five thousand dollar loan we need collateral we need your skin <laughs> here are the keys to my sports car it's parked next to the bank you got a sports car and you need a loan for five thousand dollars her documents were all right and she received the loan okay I just find it a little weird leaving a car worth 100,000 as collateral yeah not fair <laughs> to get a five thousand dollar loan so even this guy thinks it's a little odd two weeks later the woman returned she gave back the five thousand dollars and fifteen dollars in interest we're glad to help you we found out you're very rich why did you need a loan oh god oh god why what i don't know why did she need a loan because she wanted to work on her credit i don't know what else she she wanted to improve her credit score she just likes to waste people's time. We're also gonna leave my car for two weeks in, in, in the metropolis for 15 bucks and be sure no one would touch it. He's like, oh, that's actually freaking smart. <laughs> Whoever came up with that, good job. That was actually really smart. The husband came home. He didn't look at the clock on the wall. He knew it was late because he knows what it's like to when it's dark outside. He knows. Two cars passed by, so he checked the clock. It's impossible that someone could be driving at this time. And under the bed, he found his wife dead. But where was she? You wouldn't even question like where she was in the first place. Why did he look under the bed? Two cars passed by and then he looked under the bed. Oh God, I don't know. Um, he wanted to get his night light. Ah, he noticed the clock on the wall had stopped, but he still heard ticking. Oh, it was his wife's watch. How was I supposed to know it stopped? Are you cute or sexy? Choose one. Your costume for Halloween. Ooh, I think the zombie could be cute, pretty cute. Or are they just talking about me and my new Leon Lush shirt, huh? Pick a shape. Wait, you didn't answer. Oh, I guess I'm still... Okay, so I picked the zombie. Uh, I, uh, uh, I like a star because I like Mario. Not sure, I'm just picking it. When you feel sad, you prefer... When I feel sad, spend time alone. Uh, spend, yeah, definitely not clean up a home. I don't know who does that. Spend time alone. Your favorite time of the day. Uh, morning. Well, it, either morning or any time, but I think of morning. I don't like getting up, but I like the morning. When someone likes you, you feel great. 
I don't want to say satisfied, but I feel great. I mean, it's, it's nice that someone likes you. You don't want someone to not like you, but it's not the end of the world. On Sunday, you prefer to sleep in the afternoon, get up early, anything but leaving home, sleep a bit longer than usual. Well, I do none of those things because I'm always making YouTube videos. Uh, anything but leaving home, I guess. Pick your color combo. A, because I've dyed my hair those things. Results? Most A. Oh, oh. I did pick most A. I, holy crap. Without even realizing, I was picking A like every time. What the heck? Oh yeah, you know it. All right. You, every, I, dude, everyone knows it. All right. <laughs> You're determined and impressive, uh, expressive. You know all about the power of seduction. You don't go unnoticed. <sighs> <laughs> uh, is it time to end the video? Oh, I think so. Today's Scrub of the Day goes to... Osana Tim! For drawing this amazing, uh, like, fan art of me as if, if I was in the promised Neverland, so that's freaking awesome. Oh god, my, my camera's about to shut up, okay? Guys, leave a like if you enjoyed it. Alright, check out 5 Second Riddles <laughs> show or whatever down below. Subscribe for more. Uh, yeah. Okay, oh bye. Bye bye. Uh. Why can't you release you mother in this last episode? Screw you. Why can't you release you mother? And I think it's in the show. Yeah, dance while you can. Cause you won't be dancing very long. Why can't you release you mother in this last episode? Screw you. I swear in dance you may have something to do with this. I'm a little tilted. I wasn't planning on it.